Today, I got y'all with the best cigs on the game, and I'll give y'all a little tutorial for it. You know what I'm saying? I got y'all with a dribble tutorial. I've been promising this video for a minute, but first, I, I wanted to make sure I had all the best cigs for every single um, category. So, without further ado, you know, we've been grinding up. It took me a little minute. Um, I had to catch everybody in rep. You feel me? So, right now, we're, we're, in, a, we're in a good little spot. Uh, this one, these two, uh, two out of these three, you know what I'm saying? We're all close. I don't know how he's at, where he's at, but we'll talk about that another day for a later video. And yeah, so let's get right into it. You know, I don't like to waste too much of y'all time, man. I don't like to waste too much of y'all time. So let's go to my animations and I'll show y'all the best six. Now, dribble style. Starting with dribble style, I have on Kyrie, but John Stockton is a great substitute if you cannot get Kyrie Irving, bro. If you cannot get Kyrie Irving, use John Stockton. Signature size ups, I use Steve Francis, but Derrick Rose is also another good one. Regular uh, breakdown combo, I use Scoop. Aggressive breakdown combo, use Kemba. Escape moves, just Trey Young. I haven't tried anything else, to be honest. Combo moves, usually just Ja. But you can use Stephen Curry as well. Steph Curry has a really nice one. He has that nice behind the back. You feel what I'm saying? You can just hit some money with that. Get open. I really like Tim Hardaway's, but I really this little like push cross when he's coming down the court, as you just seen. That's what I really liked about Tim Hardaway's. Crossover, we use De'Aaron Fox. Um, my behind the back move is uh Stephen Curry. But the second best to me is probably Jamal Murray. This you can really debate this is the first best on the game. You know, I found this one. I was the first one on the SIG. I can officially say I was the first one on the SIG. I found this the before the game even came out, I was using it. Um spin move. I'm gonna go with Steph Curry and hesitation Chris Paul. Chris Paul's hesitation is the best. See, he has that quick little like, hold on, let me let me see if I can get the animation restarted. That one right there. We can just burst straight out that, go to the same side. And then uh, step back, I use John Wall. Uh, he has the best one on the game because he has that big hop, like uh, 2K17. And then you could just click back on the stick and do the, um, like the, the snatch. Uh, triple stat style really don't matter, but I use Kobe, and that's really it, bro. I'm gonna go ahead into the, I'm gonna go ahead into the Gatorade facility to show y'all exactly how to do all these moves, bro. I don't, I want y'all locked in, bro. All right, man. Nonetheless, now that we in the court, I can finally show y'all exactly how to do these moves. So first, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna just start with the most efficient, uh, the Steve Francis. You can't get Steve Francis. Remember, use Derrick Rose. It's the same. It's not the same thing, but. It's the same thing. You get what I'm saying? So the ball's in my right hand without touching R2. You're just gonna flick up right diagonal to do the Steve Francis. So if it's in your left hand, you flick up right. If it's in your right hand, you flick up left. And you could just spam it. You get what I'm saying? And then once you get really good with it, there's a way you could just go back and forth and just continue doing it. Next, we are going to show y'all the snatch, the John Wall snatch. This is probably my favorite move in the game. You just hold R2 and you flick down on your stick to get that. And you'll get this move right here. R2 directly down on your right stick to get that. And then you could combo out of it, you could double it and do curry. You get what I'm saying? Now, I don't want to move too fast on y'all, so I'm gonna show y'all how to do the curry. Like I said, now we just did the curry by just pressing double down on the right stick right you press down back to back times and you got the snatch the john wall and then you do the curry right now to do the curry hold r2 and flick the stick diagonal down to the opposite ball hand so if the ball's in my left hand i flick down right balls in your right hand you flick down left balls in your left hand you flick down right simple enough right we're going to do the trey young escape you just flick if the ball's in your left hand right you flick it Diagonal up right holding R2 to get this animation. Diagonal up left if the ball's in your left hand or if it's in your right hand to get. Oh my God, I'm not doing it right. Sorry, guys. There it is to get that animation. Everybody always asks, okay, well, 
how do you get the fast burst? The fa this fast burst right here. The fast burst is your dribble style. It's the Kyrie dribble style. But if you don't have the Kyrie dribble style, then you have to combo a move together. So you'll have the momentum. Everybody knows how to do a momentum dribble, right? I hope. If not, I'll tell y'all. Listen, R2, you're going to... I put my left stick... My left stick... Uh, my left stick up diagonal toward the um, opposite ball hand to get my momentum. And then you just burst out of it. You burst out of it. So for me, let's say, let's say you don't have Kyrie dribble style and you wanna you wanna get that fast burst. It's gonna be you do a move, let's say you do a Trey Young, or you do a momentum, and then you burst, and you'll get the fast burst. And that's really it, guys. It's not really much to it. Like, honestly. Honestly, the more you practice, the better you'll get at dribbling. Literally. The, uh, everything I'm doing is the same moves I just showed y'all. I'm just comboing them up. I'm just changing them together, bro. Look, that's the John Wall. John Wall, step back. John Wall, Curry, momentum, snatch. You know, <laughs> it's just, it's all comboing it up. Um, If this helped, if you guys want another video, I think in the next one, I'll drop an advanced dribble tutorial to show y'all exactly how I change my moves together with the hand cam. But I really wanted to drop these six for y'all and make sure that y'all are moving out here too. So, yeah, uh, I appreciate all y'all. We're almost at 300 subs. Um, leave a like, leave a sub, and I'm out.